Yeah. All right, cool. All right. Now, for those who are going to be watching this, I am Lexington Steel or Do Love Nine, whatever. Introduce yourselves, gentlemen. <laughs> well, uh, Adam, you can go first. All right. Uh, yo, what's good, Galactic Gang? Uh, it's your boy, Galactic Infinite. Back at it again. Yeah, what's good, guys? This is your boy, John, aka Enemy. I go by many tags, probably like once a week. I think my tag, but right now it's Enemy, so just call me Enemy. Or you call him Stunner, you know what I'm saying? Rich in six months. You know rich in six months. But you know, rich in six months. Okay, and today, just so we can uh, you forget get about this channel. To, oh, it's in this oh, oh, yeah. X, bro. <laughs> I forgot <laughs> you were in you. It's FCOD. Alright, so yeah, like I was saying, um, we're gonna get uh, this tier list going on. Just something short for the, the channel. I got a new laptop, so I'm gonna try to do some short stuff like this. But basically, long story short, this is a swag tier list. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, there's a, a, a plethora of characters in Smash Ultimate. Some swaggy, some aren't. We're gonna dive right into it. So, uh, we're gonna start from the bottom, work our way to the top, and we're gonna explain our, uh, our our reasoning for having character where they are. So there's gonna be, I don't think we need this many tiers. Wait, so we're having five, five tiers? tiers or six? Yeah. Good. I mean, this character almost. Ha I mean, this roster has almost like a hundred freaking characters. On yeah. Here. I mean. Yeah. All right. Sponge drip. Sponge. That means it sucks all the 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 moist the drip the the, the swagginess have been sucked up so there's no drip whatsoever actually let's call that something else on swag zero or sip zero percent nutrients <laughs> oh my god nutrients no swag that's what nutrients <laughs> Nutrients. How to say, bro? How do you spell nutrients? That's nutrients. That's nutrients. <laughs> oh, there it is. Okay. Zero percent nutrients. Uh, D tier. You know, we can work with that. Actually, no. That's C tier. Shoot. Oh yeah, you're gonna be hearing my uh, mouse touch or my the touchpad. You know, the touchpad a lot, so <laughs> you're gonna have to deal with that. I don't have a mouse. <laughs> I probably should invest in a mouse because listen to this shit. Yeah, it's gonna be a lot of clicking. All right, what's this? D -tier no, we should, gonna be called? we should call D tier simp tier. <laughs> no, this isn't. It's not. It's not a matter of you know doing anything uh, late. It's just that belonging. you don't possess the the. <laughs> you don't possess certain qualities to be driven. All right, then call it a bit. Call it the bitch boy tier. <laughs> bitch boy tier. Um, I'm gonna call it a matrix tier. <laughs> matrix. 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 Juice. Matrix. Juice tier. We can work with that. <laughs> if the covenant made a cologne, matrix juice. Uh, uh, B tier, cool, cool with, cool, cool, yeah, cool with. A tier, uh, they straight, you straight. <laughs> so All right, there it is, and then swag. All right, here we go. All right, so. Obviously, we already know um, who to immediately put on 0% nutrients. We want to be mean characters. Yeah, all, put every fucking thing out for you. Nah, they if don't belong. Using, if you're using a me character, you don't possess any kind of swag or skill uh, in this game. Yeah. Um, I mean, and you nah. chose that route, too. You chose the route. You. You could obviously not use these characters, but the fact that you look at all of these people and, and you're you like, I want to use these characters, <laughs> you're done. No, all right. it's also a time waster because you know you have to make your, uh, how do you say, let's say you're in tournament and you know you're trying to get out of bracket or you're just trying to play and your round one has to make a new brawler. Like, and then, like, and exactly. Then 
and, and then, then they try to make some medics. They try to make some <laughs> meme out of it, like you're funny. <laughs> you're just done. You're just done. Like, like, ooh, ooh, the like, uh, like uh, why do bad things happen to good people? <laughs> ooh, his ooh, tag. Is... Why is that his tag? We're gonna put Meat Gunner at the end. Because <laughs> he mains freaking uh, Guy Fieri. That's hilarious. But that's yeah. hype. See, those are the type of players you get. Flavor Town. <laughs> those are the type of players you get. I uh, have deleted Flavor Town off my console ten times. Flavor Town. Let's see. Uh oh, shoot. Yeah, we're gonna put Yoshi at this list. You're using Yoshi, you're a scumbag. <laughs> you possess no nutrients in your diet. You 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 wanna just mash, jump out of everything. You know what I'm saying? Like you just wanna... you're just antimony. <laughs> See, at least when Ant's money uses Palutena, you know what I'm saying? He can it's do manageable. Stuff. But yeah, like we can do it. But if you're a Yoshi player, and, you have, and you're like, <laughs> and you like have a neck beard and tattoos and stuff, you gotta look at yourself in the mirror like, bro, what are you really representing here? No, Yoshi it's just like... <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit. Just drop. Bro, what happened to the screen? There it is, there it is. There it is. You <laughs> can't drop my laptop. You could choose anyone in the game, but like some people choose him because he's cute and they're like above cute. 25. Oh if my you're god, that's weird. <laughs> if, you're, if you're above the age of of uh, 15 and you call Yoshi cute? That's weird. You yeah. need to go to some psychiatric that's even, like that's spot. That's not even a good reason to make. You need to go like, see a therapist. The only give pass I can give is if you're either like a child or you're a lady. If you're a grown man, which is but if you're a grown, the, man, if you're a grown man, listen, you're typically okay. in that age bracket. Okay, listen, don't no, get you, me wrong. Yoshi's one of my favorite Mario characters. Like, yeah. But that's in the Mario franchise, not in Smash. Exactly. It's a whole different demon. The Mario characters <laughs> in this game, they're for the most part pretty swaggy. You know what I'm saying? Oh, whoa, whoa. Luigi. Oh. Oh, oh. Oh. I'm about to say. We're going to put Tony about to play. and Bowser Jr. <laughs> in this tier list. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, DJ, we, we ain't going to talk about the plant main. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, he's a, cool, he, <laughs> he's a cool dude. It's just that his character's wet. Who oh, you, Kev? Kev, bro, Kev is a freaking chat. It's just he plays the wrong character. Yeah, bro, you just, like, again, you look at the cast and you're like, oh, man, Piranha Plant. It was a meme at first. Like, I understand if you're a meme, cool. But like, I don't get the fun in playing that character. Bro, super cheese, super <laughs> cheese. Uh, let me see, Patui, Y, you know what I'm saying? Patui. <laughs> Like you just really? s flow chart and then Bowser Jr. Why does a jab why does your jab kill at the legend seventy <laughs> percent? Why do you, if you Bowser Jr. is a character where if you like forks, knives, and spoons, that's the character <laughs> for you. You like to eat, you, you pick up Bowser Jr. Yeah, that's like, uh, I think there's only one Bowser Jr. main I can respect, and that's Yoda. Yeah, Yoda Yoda is cool, dude. I mean, even he, still, he stuck with that character in four. Like, okay, he. That's still, you know, I can respect Yoda because he's <laughs> he's low key nice. But the thing is, he could be. He has DK. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> he could be so much swaggier. Like he, like you look at what he wears, right? Mm -hmm. the, the doctor outfit. He's on a mission, bro. <laughs> he's not here to entertain. He's here to do work. Bro, when I first saw Yoda Kid, I thought he was like an employee. Uh, do you work here? Like, yeah. Man, you gotta, <laughs> do you, man, gotta uh, sir, do you work here? Button, tucked in button up shirt with some khakis and like, oh, oh, you play? Oh, all right. And believe me, we are not making fun of him. All right. It's just yeah. that's that's his fit, and it shows with the character choice. That's all. Oh, okay. Ness and Lucas. Ness and Lucas. Ness and Lucas on this tier. Yeah. Free, super free. All, all those characters do it. Yeah, you better put them both right, right next both to each other. Both them. Yep. Both. Of them. All they do is that. All right, Ness and Lucas. If you, I got a reason for this. If you play Ness, all you know how to do is spam PK fire in the F smash. That's your. 
only good thing you do, and you spam PK Thunder when someone's above you. They could be at zero percent, and you immediately go PK Fire, PK Fire. Like get that shit out of my face. And if you play Lucas, and you're spamming PK Freeze just because you want a quick kill, because nobody can match out of that for some reason, which I don't understand how. Bro, you're all so glad you're Get off say, my screen. I will say Lucas is definitely the coolest out of the, 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 the list. No, he's not. Put him back where you are. Right, so, no, like, here's, here's the back. thing, right? Because if if you take away Lucas for, uh, from doing like the BK freeze cheese or whatever, bro, those combos yeah. are pretty okay, solid. Okay, like that's yeah. the, that's okay. the least I can give him. But with Ness, bro, the freaking uh, down the aura, whatever that warp spear thing is, super, Side super... Magic? Yeah, the, the PSI magnet, super lame, goes in the down air, you have an un, unreal, freak, like his noggin is super crazy, what the heck is the yo-yo at the ledge, like you come on, like you just, yeah. you just you're just asking for someone to throw just, a controller. Just, these characters are all gimmicks, <laughs> no gimmick no ass neutral. character, <laughs> Jesus no Christ. No fundies. And Big this is, cheese. and and I'm and I'm sad to say, like, there's only one way to play Ness. There's no, <laughs> there's no originality. There's no originality <laughs> to the character. So copy paste the same mode. <laughs> paste and save. Okay, I think that's. If I'm, if I'm calling it back, there's no one else. Oh. Banjo, Banjo Kazooie? No, nah, that's in the next. Uh, oh, that's in the that, next. That's uh, that's, that's not. Matrix. That's not really. Okay, all right. Yeah. That's that's in another. That's he's low. Believe me, he's definitely yeah. in this 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 <laughs> tier. But he's not. Yeah, it's only because right, of yeah. Wonder. But I think that's. Yeah. It. Oh. Forgot. <laughs> duck, 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 duck. Yeah, forgot. Yeah. yeah. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah. Forgot. <laughs> Get this fucking bing 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 fire person out of here. Get that. Uh oh, Isabel. Uh, rule no no thirty four furry bait. Yep, yeah, stays at the bottom. No one asks for her in the game. Uh, <laughs> Except for five year olds and women who love Animal Crossing. <laughs> this is these and characters. They just if you lose to them, everyone thinks you're trash. You just can't. There's but no, like, there's nobody, no way around. Nobody plays freaking Isabel or Duncan. Nobody. I'm not gonna get any matchup experience. Hold up, I got another one, Swaggy. Who? You gotta put him. Put that. Put the Wii Fit trainer up there. Put the Wii Fit trainer. Oh, oh wait, hold on. I was gonna put. I already know why, but I already know where to put Wii Fit trainer. She's, she's gonna go here, and I'm gonna tell you why. It's only because. If you pick the male Wii Fit trainer, and you do stuff, you've seen those Twitter clips, tw or not tw yeah, the Twitter clips of uh, those combos with the ball. Yeah. Solid, bro. They, but the only thing I don't like is that we're we're running, we're running the the entire time. You know what I'm saying? We're, we're, we have to chase. We have to chase you. Listen, I'm only, Belmont. I am not chasing after somebody. I'm not chasing someone who claims to be fit and i can't see i can't see you on the screen okay. like if i put her if i put we fit trainer here where'd she go where is she i can't see her oh there she is <laughs> you know what i'm saying she, like realistically she's a bland aesthetically she's not cool to look at she has a weak play style but if you get the right person they can do something, you know what I'm saying? But they have to work yeah. twice as hard as someone like Kron, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. So she's gonna go there. I think we're done with the 0% nutrients, like the uops, uber unswaggy people. Uh, <laughs> let me see you. All right, people that, who are in I this list, uh, freaking Link. Link, <laughs> Link. Um, Link got neutered, bro. Uh, Kirby. See, we can put Olimar here. It's about time. We can put Game and Watch here. Game and Watch. Uh, Man. Actually, Mega Man, he's cool. Actually, Mega yeah. Man is cool. Samus. Where's regular Where's Samus? Dark oh, Samus. 
regular Samus. It's just these characters that. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold the fuck up. Put the fucking punchy boy there. Who? Punch boy, Mr. Oh, not an air fighter. Little Mac? <laughs> yeah. Oh, of he's Matrix? Matrix keeps. We can yes, work. He's Matrix. No, you no. can't work with Little Mac. They, they all play the same, man. Well, you They right. literally only do the same two hit combos. They all and then it works. And then it works. And it's just annoying. Cause That's because no one plays Little Mac. Down tilt into unblockable kill move that kills you at like 30. <laughs> what? Uh, it's just like if you're not camping, then you just. You're not enjoying you, finding the Exactly. Because like, you got to freaking. You camp him. You're not going to box him. He has armor on everything he does. And this is a special case because no. Nobody wants to. Uh, uh, Little Mac players are really nice, cool people, so, but they chose so this life. Oh no, some of them are cool. A lot of them, GTA. Just, yeah, online though. Online Little Mac. Yeah, just F smash everywhere and they work. Freaking <laughs> dumbass cure. Uh, but all right, so let's go down the list. All right, Link. Um, Uber lame. Um, his nair. <laughs> like his bombs are trash. But like his nair goes, his nair has too much uh, priority priority okay, to be to be a character with you know all the tools in the yeah. in the in the world. His nair, right, his nair is safe on shield and it's lag. They just it, spam that mode. It you know, no sense. why do you have a safe move? You're supposed to be camping. I played against a Link with Sonic, and all they did was Nair because it beats out Spin Dash. Yeah, I and know. And then <laughs> to go, and then to proceed to throw a bunch of stuff so I can't approach. That's the those. That's the Matrix Juice Link I'm talking. And about. then they hit so hard. Everything they hit a B, forward smash, down smash, up. You got a shield. You got freaking yeah. down air. I so mean, hard. like, bro, like, come on, like, why are you using Link? It's 2020. Use someone else. I don't, I don't like the character. I get annoyed with the character. You can't do anything. Well, I can't do anything. But it's just a pain of to fight against Link players. Oh and yeah, uh, King K, King K, not King K, Kirby. Kirby should be a major. Can't, yo, yeah, you can't freaking kill this dude because he's heavy. Kirby, <laughs> oh, let's just talk about Kirby now. Kirby, uh, Nothing you know, not the swaggiest of characters, to be honest. You know, it's a Inhale, puff ball. Annoying. I mean, Inhale not even, <laughs> <laughs> not even by like the things that this thing can do. It's just like look at it, like you know, it's not, a, it's not cool. Like, it's not a cool I don't, character to use. Like, when you're picking up Kirby. Like what, bro? Like, that's, that's a character I don't take seriously. Like, not gonna lie, you could have picked anyone else. I understand you like the games, but not even any know. cool skins either. Like yeah. uh, down air, down air off ledge. <laughs> the down beat of land, they turn into a freaking spike ball. The inhale off stage. His dash attack crosses you up and it kills. What? Makes no sense. Everything crumbles off a grab. Right. You just have to camp him. And it, it, you, you just, you just, there's no need to play against, like, there's no need to play like that. It's a Kirby. This is for a Christmas week back. All right, Infinite. We got the infamous Olimar. <sighs> <laughs> oh, Let's talk about how how much Matrix is this dude is squirt. If you, if, if you get the Buzz or Myron, drop this character. If you're not an established Olimar player that actually knows how to use an, a consistent Olimar <laughs> player. If you haven't played Pikmin or or the Buzz and Myron, then please stop playing this character. You're not doing anything useful for the community. You're Just not throwing doing out any justice. Bro, when people see this game, people don't even know what game Olimar is even from. And they still I didn't know. Them. I didn't know where he was from. Logic Drop didn't even know. I There's played, no way he knew. I played Pikmin, so I know where this motherfucker is from. <laughs> and that's you and you're just a fiber. Even Brandon, he has played Pikmin, which did not know. And he's like, and when I showed him the Smash 4 game, he was like, oh, they got Olimar? He was excited. I was like, 
excuse me so <laughs> cool so unless it's like that you there's no need for you to be hovering over your uh your 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 glove over this this person yeah unless you're japanese person. too i forgot you're japanese you definitely know this okay. character yeah i don't know this character and my guys can't do anything that's like you know put it on stream you know oh my god hype man type of stuff it's all on mark bro nothing oh. they do is hype <laughs> That, really, there's nothing really hype that I could think off the top of my head. I mean, every OMR that's on stream always makes it go to game five. <laughs> they uh, take like 20 minutes. <laughs> they take 20 minutes. Like, I think the only thing I've seen cool by OMR is like the little blue Pikmin grab on a top platform. Mm. But that's like, think about it. Look, we, we're struggling that's like here. Super, that's like super situational. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we're struggling here. And that's Aren't not good. good. Uh, all right, so yeah, we there's no there's nothing left to say. Game Watch, what what is there? You know, he's he's not even uh, nobody in this play shit. Smash is old enough to really know what Game Watch is from. <laughs> uh, up the up B out of shield, up down air, shield, down air, down throw into side B, bucket. <laughs> Can't you know, super bland, super bland playstyle. It's just one of those characters that you don't have fun fighting because you have to camp him. Since he has no range and he has no protector, you gotta camp him. And not everyone wants to spend every game, <laughs> even if he's for your own. Nobody wants to get either timed out or, you know, five minute games back to back to back. That's not fun. I want, you know, Balls to the walls, aggression, you know, I'm coming at you, you're coming at me. I don't want you dash dancing across the stage just to do up the other shield. That's not cool. <laughs> and That's not the, only, a tournament for. the only reason why he's in this this tier and not the 0% nutrients is because he has a little bit more personality than he did in Smash 4, you know, with the can, freaking animations. That's, they, they, they that's stuff and animations are clean, even though they had the nerf at day one because apparently there was some controversy about yeah, it. The F Smash. <laughs> <laughs> the F -Smash. I don't get that, bro. bro, it was like 1980, bro. It was a different time. They didn't know or they didn't realize <laughs> that Indian, you know, F Smash was in like a no no. <laughs> uh, so, like, yeah, I understand. It was a business decision, but yeah, aesthetically. He looks cool to to look at, but to play against, like, come on, bro. I mean, he's really unique. I don't know if you like him, but like, since no one I mean, ever plays this character. Speaking of which, you yeah, just, you just ice know. climbers up there too. Oh, yeah. actually, no. Put ice climbers in the we can work with that. Nah, because the exception of Big D, all ice climbers do is rely on freaking uh, nah. freaking okay. grabs. No. All they do I mean, is those grabs nobody knows how to get out of. Yeah, the grabs, but the combos, they do take a mm, bit of... They, you're they, right. They do take some skill and... You're right. But they're the, super the cheesy, deficit. though. They're so yeah. cheesy. Listen, so listen. Cool. Nah, leave them, leave them where you had it. Don't even yeah, bother. they're so there. cheesy. <laughs> like, nobody... Listen, like it's no... When have you ever seen a Ice Climbers me make a top eight at a major? Big D. Big D. Actually, yeah, Big D. So, like, listen, Big D is the only person that I can really look at and say, yo, Ice Climbers is cool. He is the best Ice Climbers. I mean, when this character is like, he you know, wish he no, he doesn't, he plays Ice Climbers, but no, he's not a good one. All he does is hit side B. Exactly. Oh, side B, side B grab. That's about uh, it. D sinks. Who, who, who else uses Ice Climbers? There's someone um, in sense. I forget his name. He's him. He's him a little bit. No. But like he's Pikachu, what so that's tongue? that's what a big what? tongue is gaming. He big plays <laughs> He plays Icy. Unswaggy. Yeah, I mean it's not like so the character itself is is like it's like swaggy to a point, but then you start then but they have this flow chart way of playing. So it's kind of it makes them unswaggy. Yeah. It's not like Samus where everybody plays camping. 
but these two they rely on one thing and if they can't get it then it's 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 whatever it, it's over for you you just gotta wait if it, then it's yeah. just like okay what they hit now? really hard too for some reason they do they really they should take a smash they mm-hmm. do hit really hard. Nobody wants to play against them because you have to play anti-grab, so you can't, you can't approach. It's annoying. And you have to separate them without getting grabbed. <laughs> you grab one of them, the other one comes and that smashes you. Like, what is that? Right. Like, thing? There are certain situations. I, I would put it, I would, you know, I would put them up here. Yeah, they're, the, they're, like I said, they're the coolest out of this list. Yeah. Uh, the yeah. Samus... Samus, we don't we even need to go into it. We don't know how that works. We know. Right, how now we can go. Are we moving up the tiers now? Yeah, we don't need to discuss this. Yeah, neutral V, side B, down throw, force you to jump. You know, down, 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 down B, down B, down B, down B, down B, and down B. Down B. Oh, I'm gonna do nair off stage. I'm gonna do back air. I'm gonna freaking. It's just. Oh my god. And then they just sit also, there, and then they think that they're they, good. They do get play stuff. Also, they have a kill throw and their grab snatches you from like across the stage. Exactly. <laughs> they freaking fake chart. They cancel their charge, grab you, force you to jump through fair, multi hit, <laughs> can't land. Like lame, <laughs> bland play style. Next, <laughs> act. Hold on. I should even put them at the end. Okay, so we can work with that. These are characters that. They have a reputation of being lame, but they get the one yeah. that there are few players that they can, you know, you can still be amazed. You can still be entertained. So, for example, um, let me see. Let me DDD. see. The, <laughs> yeah, I would say I would say DDD. Uh, DDD. Yeah, DDD. Definitely yeah. up there. Characters like that, like Dr. Mario. Yeah. Who else um, can work with it? K. Rule. Yeah, actually. The K. Rool. Most, K. Rool. The most oh, big old boy. Yeah, big, big gold belly wash. Uh, uh, Jigglypuff. Um, Puff? Yeah, Jigglypuff. Uh, you can work with that. I can work with Villager. Uh, what about the uh, Pikas? What about Banjo? They, oh, okay. Pikachu. Mm. Okay, we're gonna have to wait because, from what I, my understanding is that the Pikas, they are pretty solid and busted, but like they're not easy. And yeah. aesthetically, like they're well, I'm gonna just say like Pichu is not not the coolest. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, I'm gonna put, put, yeah, we're gonna put Pichu down there because it's basically just smaller Pikachu and. It's, that's meant for booger eaters and children, as you can tell. Like, freaking, uh, who's that kid? That beat MK Leo with Pichu. Rat. Yeah, rat. You know what I'm saying? Freaking. But the thing is, well, I'm gonna have to put him up here actually because Void kind of legitimized the character. So. Yeah. So Void was playing yeah. Pichu to a point where like he, he almost won fucking. Genesis. What was it? Genesis. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I'm gonna put. Uh, there's someone else I'm thinking about. Luigi? Yeah. Oh. oh. <laughs> Luigi. He's definitely. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Because Luigi is kind of like an ice climbers, but they're way cooler to look, to watch. There's no that that's more appealing. Peach. We can work with that. Daisy. We can work with that. Um. Who? Who'd you say? Bayo. Bayo? <laughs> she's a, but she's actually a cool character. But no, she's is. not. She's a cool. She's, she's cool. aesthetically though. Fighting. Aesthetically, she is a really like, cool like, character. Like, like, All right, I'll give you that. She How about you can work? We can work with Mega Man. We can work with Mega Man. Yeah, he is, he's actually actually hold on. He's in the same boat as Bayo. He's like really lame, but he's cool. He's cool looking. It's just his gameplay. <laughs> his gameplay is just yeah. His yeah, gameplay is whack. Ro- oh yeah, Rob. 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 Of course. I said Robin. 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 Oh, Robin. Oh, that's a Matrix tier character. I'm gonna say, yeah. <laughs> that's a Matrix tier character. Freaking down throw up there. You're slow. Levin sword. 
It's, just, it's basically lame. What if you made Rob in the year 2020, what are you doing with your life? Uh, yeah, there's not too much to say on Robin. Like, you're freaking just whatever. Oh, shoot. Hold on. Let's go back. Freaking Matrix. Oh. 0% this, nutrient this, tier. This, 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 why is really? nobody asks for the everybody asks for this character in the game and then nobody uses this character and when yeah, when they do use, like, when they do yeah when they do use this character nothing but cheese nothing but lame they want to go for <laughs> down b they want to go for side b off the ledge they want to do <laughs> up b slight they want to do no, everything no, no, no. to not play the game that's crack that is the least swaggiest character in this game. Ridley is the uh, character in Zelda? Yeah, between. R Ridley basically is a weaker Charizard. Like a less <laughs> cool Charizard. And people act for this character, they got this character, and they don't want to use this character. They don't play him. <laughs> I think that's cool for right- oh wait, we can work with Rosa. Wait, Zelda, Banjo, oh, Rosa? Yeah, yeah, we, we can, can work, work with Rosa. Rosa. We can work with Rosa. Rosa, yeah. She's a wife, so I, I can see that. Zelda, Zelda, Zelda. No, Zelda is under the only dream. Every Zelda plays the same. All they do is run away. But her design, well, we're going to have to put her in the middle, because her design is definitely much better than her. That's a I hate the design. That shit was terrible. Bro, they gave us Breath of the Wild Link, but they didn't give us Breath of the Wild Zelda. Uh, we can work with Corn. And, and then, plus, they gave us Breath of the Wild Sheep. Yeah. <laughs> like, what? I want to put Byleth in there because all they do is Nair. Yeah, I put Byleth with that extended ass yeah, I put Byleth and freaking Nick because all they do is Nair and then they just have Blame. these freaking. Uh, uh, it's just. I don't know, bro. It's just like their game dude. Bro, that Nair is crazy. We gotta move up. We gotta move up to Cool Whip. Uh, okay, so here we go. Let's let's do this. All right, so we can work with this. Da, uh, D -D -D. He can be hyped with the right but, hands. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what can do with D -D -D. Be lame. He is a super uber cheese. Down a dash attack at the ledge should not kill at 50. Side B. Side B. Side B. Ledge. Gordos. But then, but then again, you look at sets like you remember back in Smash 4, Zaki, right? Bro, yeah, no yeah. more excited to see DDD at that particular moment in time. So it's he, like he, stuff he, like he that. Plays ultimate. He's still a really good D. It's just Japanese players are actually hype to watch because they approach with every character, including <laughs> DDD. <laughs> Uh, he's he's just a wacky character, but he's like fun wacky. He's not like you know, it's not like Zelda mm -hmm. where, you, where you don't like what DDD do, do you know? Is is gonna box with box? Who does that? <laughs> like no, you exactly. Nobody's gonna box with DDD, but it's just like you know, some moves shouldn't kill in my opinion. Dash attack should not kill. It's a high risk move, but come on, man, kill super early. Um. Yeah, so it's I, I get entertained by watching DDD, just not playing against it. Dr. Mario is the same thing. It's like, why is he in this game? He just is a slower, more hit hard, like hard hitting Mario. Yeah, he's just, just really slow. He hits hard. hard. Same thing with Luigi. The same. Oh god, same thing with Luigi. They just relies on grab and down B. Yeah, they have a zero to death. They can yeah, they have a zero to death, which is cool to watch. It's just not in it. It's like nobody wants to play against a Luigi that just fishes for grabs and then the grab. It's really goes. annoying. All you hear is <laughs> he just <laughs> dash attack for some reason is annoying to me. He also has a lot of kill power with tornado up smash. A B, side B, random is fire. Yeah, like, but then, but then again, they're like bittersweet because the side B, you know what I'm saying, is hype sometimes. Like, you know, you get a side B off stage. If it's a truly big brain, like tranquility size brain play, Luigi can be up there, but you know, he's not going anywhere above this tier. 
Yeah. K Rule, he just annoys the hell out of me. Uh, K Rule, yeah, it's not fun to fight K Rule. All they do is side B, get the cannon at ledge. Uh, they have Fair a lot of kill out. power. Fair comes out super fast. He's a big they dude. Got, just use his they got buff. He's, he's, a, he's fast too. He's pretty fast for a heavy. Right. Um. The, the freaking blunderbuss thing. Like, yeah, that's annoying. <laughs> Neutral B. Uh, I don't know. Like behind them. You, you try to roll behind them, you still get hit by it. All K rules look for. They have the Mario syndrome where once you're off stage, they're always going to do down or down air, back, back air. Yeah. Up air. Just what the heck? Uh, uh, ups. Up. We, up, up, we don't talk about that shitty up air. Hold on. Up air kills at like it's like a D D dash attack. But if you miss that up air, you know how vulnerable. Yeah. Well, that's that's the trade off. You get punished hella fast for it. But think about it. They're gonna come down with a nair. You you don't have a great enough punish in the air if you miss, except for like a back air. But then again, uh, I love watching K rule do up B into the stratosphere. Entertaining, <laughs> best taunts too. He has one of the, some of the best taunts. Yeah. Best theme, best look, best trailer. Well, not best trailer. One of the best trailers. So he's kind of 50-50. That's why he's here. <laughs> Nobody. Uh, <laughs> with no uh, so. well, 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 wait, you forgot Banjo. Banjo Kazooie. Banjo is a cool character. Oh, you're actually right. He's a cool character. It's just side B and all that stuff. He, yeah, he was a, he's one a cool of my, character one of my to look at. Characters. <laughs> he's really cool um, to look at. Guys like gaming franchise, but when they put him in the game, he was actually they made requested. Him a, a totally cuck character. All they do is the same. They put Banjo in for the fan service. Side B. Side grenade. B down this is B. not fun to fight. It's just think about great. it. What other reason would they have put banjo in other than fan service? Well, like, I mean, there's uh, there's no other game to promote. <laughs> <laughs> people so, ask for it, but people I mean, still don't play banjo kazooie. I mean, that's about it on that. Like he he has some cool he has really cool skins, except you know for a little bit cool stage. Yeah, he has just, some of the best cosmetics. Really cool stage. It's just his game play. The music is pretty good. Yeah. The music, just, like, he's fit yeah. for this game. It's just like, they really made him into a lame character with the Wonder <laughs> Wing properties. Well, that one's though, the DLC characters. Yeah, it, I think out of the DLC characters, he is the least swaggy. Wait, hold up. We're forgetting another DLC character that should probably belong in Zero Nutrients. Ooh. Hero. Hero? No, I see, I know, I already know. I was gonna, Hero's a cool character, to be honest with you. He's very Because if you think, like, we'll, 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 we'll get into that. But let's get into Jigglypuff. And <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna go on down the list. Jigglypuff, uh, very scary character at times. Yeah, uh, nobody really wants to fight Jigs, because one of, first of all, it's boring, because all they do is jump. They have no projectiles and no disjoints, so they have to get really close to hit you. So it's just a waiting game. But sometimes the plays that come from Jigglypuff players yeah, are they so godlike. Like, I remember back in uh, Smash 4, it was Captain L and Larry Lur, and it was a Vancouver tournament or whatever. It was game five. Bro, he pulled out the clutches of press to get that that game and everybody popped off and when do you hear people popping off with jigglypuff you know <laughs> uh the shield break thing is cool at times it's not cool to deal with when they're just doing it because it's this you know super super you know shield yeah pressure. it lasts really long it lasts really long for the super spot. long it lasts too long the hitbox is massive <laughs> uh nobody should be having that kind of you know power and you're this small um what else freaking up up there rest is annoying or yeah that's up there up there rest you know back here 
stupid. Yeah, most yeah. Uh, Jigglypuff Puff is just very you know straightforward character. Like what you see is what you get. See that there's no Jiggly Puff that pulls some like weird ass confirms that you've never seen. Very flow chart. So like if you know what she's gonna do and avoid it, it's not hard to try. Yeah. Overall, these characters are 50-50. They're not trash swag, but they're just not somebody. You get hype over unless you have a certain person like villager you know he, he has cool skins but i would never want i never look at villager and like yeah i'm, I'm so entertained by an animal crossing character you know what I'm saying he's way more swaggy than isabel but it's only because of the skins i know some swaggy villager players they're actually like they do like some pretty crazy tree setups and pretty crazy like when they when they pocket something they throw it at you and they confirm it's like something crazy that's pretty cool but that's about it that's all they got going for them <laughs> that's about it that's all they his, got. Yeah, his all they uh there's other thing though is when you do his run and he turns around the little animation that's yeah. that's fun you know stuff like that bowling ball at the ledge that's yeah, okay that's whatever you got a bowling ball for next match next mm -hmm. Pichu. <laughs> Just an annoying ass rat that is fast. Hard, fast. It's hard, hard to hit fast. Hard to hit. Hard to combo. <laughs> you know, air loops. What else can you ask for? If you, you pick up this character because you want to win or you because you like Pokemon or you're a 13 year old that is on Zero's channel, whatever. <laughs> um, but you know, can't take away anything. Combos are probably really hard to do. Over, not overpowered, but just really busted. Does damage to himself though, so be he careful. Died early, lightest in the game. Yeah. That's <laughs> uh, why you could throw out like the most non-kill moves and you can kill him. Right. Uh, not even Sonic can really do Pichu. That's a problem because Sonic is way more swaggy than Pichu. That moves on us to the ladies, Peach, Daisy, Rosa, Corn, and Violet. What do these the ladies really have to offer? I hold don't on, know. Hold on. You gotta, you gotta be correct though. There's a male and female version for the for the two. Oh yeah, for realize. Violet and Corn, correct. I mean, I'm sorry, but I don't. If you, uh, my reasoning is like, if you mean the female ones, you're just a wife and boy. Yeah. You're just a you're just a hentai lover. I'm sorry. <laughs> the, the male corn is actually the best corn, even though I played the, the blue male corn. The girl corn has the best looking, like PFP. Yeah. But the the male yeah. is the is the best overall. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Just by the design. But but, uh, but they Violet, the corn does have some really good skins. So not gonna lie. Mm -hmm. Corn has some so really good skins. Violet, yeah. you know, everybody picks you because, you know, she has little knee highs or whatever. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but think about what this character actually just does. And out of the DLC, she's actually, this person's actually the least swag, not the engine. Uh, what, is, what do they do? They just nair to approach and it crosses up the shield. Uh, up B from everywhere. Uh, fair is super they just long. have a left. Everything breaks shield. Everything breaks shield. Think, try to land, try to land against this character up there. You know, so many confirms off of something so dumb. You can, you can shark the edge. But then again, somebody a Violet pulls out the down B. Ooh, I'm, I'm nutting every time. <laughs> it's hard to say that. Hard to say that someone, about. someone come get the hentai lover man's. <laughs> nah, not me, fam. <laughs> not me. I don't know about that one, Chief. <laughs> I, like I said before, you know, Beach Daisy Rosa, what else? What can they offer, really? You know, nothing really exciting coming from them except broken ass combos. It's like hard to, I mean, they are pretty hard to play. Yeah, they are, very technical. they are pretty hard yeah, to play. Yeah. Uh, 
stuff that you know well, if you play like characters like that then you have to win neutral touch as much since they don't have any gimmicks exactly i mean i think the rng factor is the only thing that makes them makes them somewhat refreshing them pulling a bomb every once in a while is hilarious <laughs> Mm. But Mr. Saturn, like Saturn it. breaks the shield, and it can screw them over too. Like you pull a Saturn, yeah. When you want to turn it, walking across the, walking across the stage. Ooh. Yeah. So that that's that's as far as that goes. Uh, so we're gonna go on to cool with. Now we can get into some swaggier characters. So first things first. Mega Man, cool with Bayonetta. Uh, shoot, damn, this should be here. I don't think her. Froggy Boy. This is gonna be harder than I thought. Yeah. Pretty Even though it pains me to say that, Frog Boy. Yes. Inkling. Inkling is a cool character. Uh oh, well we got the Bowser up here. Actually, Bowser is super cheese, but. What about uh Mojo Jojo Monkey? Yes, that's right. DK, DK of course. Cool. Pac Man, cool. Mewtwo, cool. Diddy. Diddy Kong. Yeah, he's actually at work with that kind of character. Yeah. Because there's not a lot of things Diddy Kong is doing that's making me like, what? Oh, wait. Actually, hold on. He is cool. Up B. <laughs> the Up B joint. Big the Cat. Uh, the, the, the the cat, I was gonna wait. I was gonna wait. Cinderwar is actually a way cooler character than that. Yes. Yeah. Uh, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Toon I mean, Link, it's actually really cool. Young I'm Link, cool. See, I was gonna wait, but I don't know because I really don't like Pikachu like that. So I'm actually gonna put him in a cool character in, in the lane of cool. Uh, Lucario. Lucario. Lucario actually, he's, like, he's that's really, he's that's actually, really, he's actually really cool. He's really cool. No, he's not. Yeah, he is. What? He's actually a cool. Actually, yeah, I'll, I'll put him in here. I'll put him in cool with. So the, the, I'll explain cool. why. Oh, we'll, we'll get into him first. Then. Uh, let me see. Oh, I don't know if I can put him here. Put him here yet. Oh, the pits. <laughs> Oh shoot! Oh shoot! I forgot they were here. Oh, hold on. <laughs> That's oh, how you know their fucking franchise is dead because you don't even know ah, where we're we'll put them fifty fifty because like they're very basic, very you know, raisin brand type yeah. type play style. Like they're not acting. Mm, okay, I would say Dark Pit is actually the cooler one out of the two. Even right. though I mean, he does have the most potential too. Yeah. yeah. Uh, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. There's, there's, um, there's suit. There's uber cool people. I don't want to put on here yet. Yeah. Um, we'll explain. You have to wait a little bit for the next. Uh, Palutena, she's kind of cool. I think that's about. Oh, Pokemon trainer. PT and then probably Wario. Yeah, probably Wario. And then Ike. I'm gonna put Ike, and he'll be our last person. Okay. So here we go. Lucario. I I like this. I like the design. I like his moves. I like the way you can play. His aura, rage shit, is stupid. That's so nobody dumb. should get it. But like, what? All, all the bad. All the bad. All the bad uh, all the good outweighs the bad and overall yeah. he's such a cool like yeah, one of the coolest cool Pokemon yeah I like his moveset a lot alright <laughs> alright so Mega Man is also in that same bracket obviously swaggy game franchise swaggy yeah. swaggy skin swaggy game swaggy, cool swaggy trailer music. he had a cool trailer smash for and his playstyle cool his playstyle was kind of whack had, Music. Music. Uh, what else? Let's see. Uh, his skins, even though they're not as I want them to be, he still has some really nice colors. Like, this is a... This is a legacy character done correctly. 
to fit in the Smash game uh, criteria. Uh, you know, back air is a cool move. Like he has cool moves from his games. You know, the back air, which is the his upbe, the blade it includes rush. Yeah, the, the, with the rush is pretty cool. Up tilt is a sh just big old sh hard knuckle shuriken. The down air <laughs> is a spike. You know, there's not like there's not anything I can say. He's just really annoying to fight. It's just that he's a yeah. really fun character to to, to yeah. have in the game. Bayonetta, I don't know much I about see. Bayonetta, but she is a baddie, of course. Cool, <laughs> cool design. <laughs> cool, cool, lead, cool design. Uh, swaggy uh, games. Swaggy music. Uh, One of the her, best content in the game. Very charismatic. She's very charismatic. Uh, I mean, not not. I mean, if you're looking at the the, the the roster, there's no one else in the game that has four guns on each of her limbs. <laughs> uh, Bayonetta and Bayonetta Two skins stage. You know, booty. You know, what else can you <laughs> ask for? <laughs> uh, you know, just overall, she's like a caters to the the uh, mature type of audience that ha like likes likes those types of games and kind of paved the way for other DLC that we're going to get into later. Uh, and then, you know. All that other stuff, and then here comes your boy Greninja. Uh, Adam, you want to take the lead on this? All right. So the reason Greninja belongs in Cool Whip and not anywhere higher, not anywhere lower, is because he's about. If you look back in Smash Four, he was kind of average. People loved him in the beginning, though, and so he got the nerfs. Nerfs just nerfed his character, but in Ultimate, they made him better. A lot of his combos look as waggy as hell now, like. You can go for down tilt, up smash now. You can go for up tilt, up air, up smash, depending on, like, drag downs and shit. He's got a lot of tools to his kit that make him a swaggy character, and he looks flashy as hell when you do it. Yeah, I was going to say, uh, I really liked that, well, even though he was in one of my favorite trailers, which is the Smash 4 joint, uh, just aesthetically... My Pokemon, and he is my main for Smash 4 and technically an ultimate as well. Yeah. yeah, Greninja. There's not a lot of complaints. Uh, he's very he's a intermediate slash advanced type of character, so there's not a lot of complaints that I can have if you like lose this character. Uh, Nair is kind of a small but good move. Like I I I always have trouble hitting it, but you know if you can hit it with proficiency. Uh, you know, it leads yeah. into a lot of other stuff that looks cool, and all the players that use Greninja... Nair, up, down till, you can go for Nair, up till, up smash. Uh, he just has a really good dash attack, really good combo. I mean, they always fish for dash attack or down till, but that's like, you know, that's whatevs. Vinia... Yeah, I, it's, like the, a quick, it's like a quick move, too, because you're right back on yeah. the yeah. Vinia being one of the most notable Greninjas, uh, usually show, showcases the cool, like, how much of a cool character this is uh shadow sneak kind of a uh, a gimmicky move but it's actually used when used correctly um pretty hype the shadow sneak uh counter one of the best uh moves that just can do damage like i've seen the counter be used to go upwards and then they like convert into something like you know stuff like that you know you just can't it also it also down. spikes on stage yeah i've gotten mm -hmm. spiked by it from a hadouken i didn't know that it did that <laughs> you know so there's not a lot cool confirms you know just your you know one two buckle my shoe character you know uh inkling same thing with the as like villager but just cooler skins on point New, I think a perfect iteration for the newer generation of Smash. Uh, music, <laughs> move set, uh, broken. You know what I'm saying? But you know. yeah, I feel like Inkling just has a really unfair move kit. He's amazing edge guarding. She can box. She can zone with flat bomb men and her neutral B. She has pretty much an, an invincible dash grab since you can't hit her. She's always hard to hit because she's always dashing. You don't know what she's going to do whatever that. 
Ink mechanic is crazy. You can rack up so much off of ink. He also has when conditions with roller and up throw up there. This character just has pretty much a lot of stuff that like no other character has. And she can easily invalidate some characters' whole moveset just for like a couple moves, which is actually pretty crazy. It is pretty crazy, but uh yeah, <laughs> I know that uh one skin with the dude in the, the moccasins like that's <laughs> come on bro that's that's screaming yeah, cool with it. which one is the dude with the moccasins it's the dude it's like the inkling boy with the blue shoes oh he got like the van yeah he got the van the or something like that the glass oh you're talking about hipster <laughs> oh yeah, yeah hipster bro and that's, that's my know, favorite skin that's literally my inkling in splatoon 2. Yeah, that's a pretty, that's a pretty cool skin. Uh, let me see, uh, let's see, what's DK, you know, we already know, uh, grabbing. Uh, he's just a very fun character to play, basically, that's yeah. what it comes down yeah. to. DK is pretty fun, yeah. Uh, some, some of the hype, hypest move, uh, moments come from DK players. I know yeah. from, uh, what the heck is it called, freaking Phoenix, Phoenix, whatever it's called now. Um, but it was called Lunar. Uh, oh, Phoenix Smash. Yeah, Phoenix Smash. You had Callus using DK, and he like destroyed this little mag. <laughs> the cargo <laughs> throw, uh, reading with DK, the side B, breaking shield. You know, all that stuff is just cool. And then you got Pac-Man, a, a guy, a legacy character, with some of the coolest setups I've ever seen introduced uh taunts on point he has taunts so much charisma good. yeah they put a lot of you could tell they put a lot of time and looked up a lot of stuff for like taunts for like his character alone since you know most of his iterations are like 2d just him you know eating like you know little bits and running away from ghosts so you can tell that they put a lot of time since most of his models are like 2D and like most of his games are not that like in depth, but they still like, you know, put a lot of time into this character alone. Uh, yes, I don't know. Like, I think his skins are kind of bad. So skins most of them are, are just like, like yeah, most of his skins are just like a striped color on like his hand, mm. on like his gloves. I can't don't know how to rock the right Air Forces. <laughs> but yeah. then there's this one like plaid boots. Yeah, he has the oven mitts too. I, mean, the oven I think, mitts. I think um, the the other thing is the Pac-Man tech is just very unique. Like, you know, how many times have you seen the bell combo or like, Yeah, Pac-Man <laughs> Yeah, like you go in this room know so much with Pac-Man, you're gonna start getting very creative and like the like the big brain Pac-Man stuff starts to kick in. So that character has a lot of setups that can go any way. So creativity is just run like a sh like run amok just straight with pac-man's creativity and it's actually pretty crazy what you can do with the character link with all the fruit and all the you know grabs and shit and all the follow-ups right you even have a freaking galaga which is, that's actually pretty cool legendary game you know. <laughs> uh mewtwo uh you know not i don't know a lot about mewtwo uh i just know that aesthetically again swag mewtwo. very yeah mewtwo. very cool looking character uh his moves are pretty you know they yeah, statement cool making moveset. you know yeah move set statement making uh you know just looking at him makes you want to like play the character i know smash 4 mm -hmm. it was kind of the same but you know very busted um spike you know he, he's got some powerful moves so it's pretty like i said not a lot to say uh and diddy kong is kind of the same way uh, you know, i guess the least out of this whole group probably the least swaggy least cool it's just that his uh rocket barrels like do funny stuff <laughs> Yeah, his final smash is cool. Uh, you know, banana plays always awesome. You know, it's whatever. Link, Toon Link, Pikachu, 
they kind of are in the same bracket to me because it's like yeah they're kind of just gonna rush you they're kind of just gonna rush you down in terms of gameplay but as like looking at them as a character very interesting not boring to look like to watch even though young link is just a smaller version of link where they could just zone but they at least approach and make the game interesting young link is the same way pikachu if this you know they're just gonna go for loops but it's whatever i mean loops are always awesome so that's just them in a nutshell pit dark pit and palutena kind of have a similar game plan but dark pit kind of just like you know yeah, I what also think Dark Pit has some of the best win animations in the game. He just likes to talk trash about you, which is pretty fun. And they have pretty good taunts. Oh yeah, pretty good tunes. where's your princess now? You know. <laughs> he has a con- he's the only character that has a confirm. Well, he is one of the three characters that have a confirm off of the F- uh, final smash. Yeah, that's yeah. pretty cool. That's pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> Back throw always leads in the final smash like think about that um yeah. wow wow i mean of course can anything mm-hmm. palutena <laughs> just overall her design is cool yeah, is i think cool. her moveset and everything is cool yeah yeah she has really good taunts too i think her animations are pretty cool and she has pretty cool but, you um, know her gameplay uh Gameplay, yeah, it's who, who, if you have, yeah, if you have solid points, it's not hard to play a character. Invincible, that, and, and the two invincible moves, by the way. And her shield, two invincible moves back here in dash attack. Uh, she has a safe bear. She has stuff like grab, man. Yeah, Uber cheese. Uber, Uber cheese. Really good projectile. She just has a really good moveset. Yeah, she's, I don't think I, one of her yeah. moves is bad. I think the thing about Palutena is that it's not only her nair, it's just her overall move set that makes her pretty busted. So I mean, it's yeah. at least at least it's all it's all around. It's not just one move. So yeah, all of her moves. Are pretty she's good. really dangerous. Pokemon trainer, uh, you know, switching between three different Pokemon, I think is cool. You know, the Pokemon yeah. trainer itself not the swaggiest. Uh, Unless it's uh, a female Pokemon trainer. Yeah, I mean that's that's the preference. I mean, but like I said, the, the the female Pokemon trainer does have a little bit more drip. You know, what I'm saying the jeans and the the, the, the shoes. And the the reason the female trainer is better is because the voice actor. With the Gucci. How do you neuter the male Pokemon trainer voice actor like that? You all look great. Yeah. Like that's what he sounds like. Like he sounds like a fucking bitch. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Like, yeah, you they, all did great. Nice yeah, work, they, Charizard. Nice work, they, Charizard. Like, come they, on. They did downgrade Sounds like to fucking the Jason Griffith. <laughs> yeah, they did downgrade oh, to the cut type of voice. So he sounds like a simp. But. He sounds like a simp. I yep. do like the girl trainer because she got the, she got the Gucci bag. And I think her, I think her skins are better than most of the male skins. Cause I like pink guard, I like red guard, I like purple guard. Those are pretty cool skins. I could care less about Pokemon. <clears throat> <coughs> All right, Apple. <laughs> Don't remember what's on my forearm. Remember what's on my <laughs> nine, baby. All right, nine, All right Wario. <laughs> Shoot, let me tell you something. As much as I don't. I, I, you know, I don't have a problem with Wario. It's just this freaking waft annoys me. That's the only thing I hate about this character. Everything else, that, very exciting. Diet, diet 30 at 40. Diet anywhere in condition. Uh, but other than that, like, this is a very cool character. Very, very, ca- he caters well to his just overall personality. Yeah. Like, uh, big mouth, you know what I'm saying? Very charismatic. Really good skins. He only has like one or two bad skins. 
very, he makes sounds like, you know, Luigi and Mario, so he makes sounds like he is. The taunts, he says moves. the taunts, the moves. he has a crawl. He has a crawl. <laughs> <laughs> they designed this character pretty well, uh, as well as he, Ike. He's, he's always chasing the bag. You know, oh, he's always movie. chasing the bag. It's always delicious, you know what I'm saying? He's never starving. War- His pockets are War- always fat. Mario wear, you know, chasing the bag. You know. The bite off stage. <laughs> yeah, he, don't, he also has a really, he's a really different character, so I like that. Really Wario Man. Game. Wario Man in itself. Oh, Wario Man, Swaggy. Everything about it. Okay, here's my Ike. Ike? Ooh. Ooh, swaggy F smash or final smash. Swaggy Fight skins. Fights for his friends. Fights for his friends. Simplistic moveset. Not too difficult yeah. to understand and use. A really cool good voice model. Acting. Cool model. A really good model. Yeah, really good voice acting. Really cool moveset. Yeah. That's an overall solid kit. Solid, solid. So, I mean, that's. That's what it does. I mean, we're getting down to the wire here. I mean, ooh, we're at the U straight category. Now, this is <clears throat> this is the level. Now, you got to think about this carefully now. This is the level before the ultimate swag characters. And we already pretty much swag. already know <clears throat> who's going to be up here. Yeah, I have a good feeling. Right, I have a good feeling we already know. I think ZSS belongs up there with U straight. So yeah. straight, Meta Knight is not the most popular character, but he's straight. ZSS. Yes, How about just do the row there? Like, just go from that row. Yeah, just, just, just leave it in the row and then pull up and then put it up. up there. Oh, okay. I'm going to just... Hold on, I'm going to have to... Yeah, that's easy. Oh, okay. I'm going to just have to do it like this then. All right. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you straight. I mean, they're self explanatory. Yeah, like, they're self explanatory. Yeah, there's a lot of good Meta Knight players. Uh, Meta Knight, swag, so... swaggy colors, swaggy game. All of the Star Fox people. It's all of them. All of them. There's a wolf. Although, although, since I'm very biased, I'm, I'm, I'm main mean, wolf. Well, not main. I think oh, yeah. Wolf. Let's I not think, talk about that. That's honestly, actually, you don't main wolf, boy. Yeah. I, I think wolf is the swaggiest species, but we're not gonna think of the rest of the fire and people. <laughs> Rom, Roy, Rom. Rom. I think Roy is swaggy. He's swaggier than Rom? Mm hmm. Yeah. Way swaggy. Yeah, definitely way swaggy. Well, I don't know if it actually seen her in the pool when they put Mark. You know, or the sharing tips. A lot of these are self-explanatory. Yeah, a lot of them. We don't have to dive deep into it. Oh, hero. We don't have to dive deep into it, but there are some characters we're going to go into. Uh, okay, so let me see. Um, no, no, she's Mario, Sherry. Mario, and then. Sheik Mario, I'm gonna put. I'm actually gonna make a hot take. Wait, who else did I say? Terry? Yeah. Actually, hold on. He's actually super swaggy. He's just stupid. Uh, hold on. Um, I think. Don't you do it. I think Simon. It, I think Richter's way cooler than Simon. Okay. But, I mean, even though they're the same. The but, designs and the way they like, yeah they it's just because like yeah. simon is like a, <laughs> simon is an old man you know and then simon is like a barbarian yeah. yeah simon more anime and more for the youth you know exactly so it's just all of that it's just uh i think that's about okay so we basically well then we can just basically just finish this off There's going to be a lot of loud taps in the edit. <laughs> Shoot. <laughs> <laughs> and obviously the loud in the Yes. And this is not me being biased. Everybody this is, thinks. This is common knowledge. This is just common knowledge. I don't give a shit because both two out of my like, three names are going to be in swaggy. Yeah, like everybody thinks these characters are swaggy. Like, this isn't even a question. They've been swaggy for years. 
so I haven't been this writing for years. I just so happens to be. Like, come on, uh, I can't imagine. It being, I don't think Snake has Swaggy, but there's some people that can fuck with Snake, so I can fuck with it. The reason I put Snake and Swaggy is because. No, but I can see why. Cause there's people that are able to hit some nice ass shit. Oh, it's not even that. It's like the fact that at that time when they were like, oh, Snake and Smash, he's a Metal Gear Solid character. Like, there's. You put him in the game. Like, there's no way. historically, that was just so monumental. Like, you know, there, there's no way I couldn't put him after all that. Yeah, solid game. Who would have thought? I wouldn't have thought. And the same thing goes with Terry. Like, that's such a. That's such a like god that's, like that's a curveball in my opinion. That was one of the most curveball characters. It's just cause like his legacy. Being in being that all of his he's one, fighting, oh, he's one of the OG fighters. Exactly. And that's the same like, thing with Snake. Like, one of the fighters in Pioneer. I mean I would have loved these. So I would have to power and Tekken though. Yeah, they do. And then the best thing. To be fair. Out of these, Shulk and Boy probably are at the bottom of this list, which isn't bad. Really bad. But, so we're gonna yeah. briefly go through this. I don't think Meta Knight should be at the tippy top. I think Meta Knight belongs lower to U Street, yeah. I think ZSS belongs right where she is at the first spot. Yeah, okay, so uh, ZSS, no need to explain. She's just a very cool. Mar that's all we gotta say. Mar Mar just. He's been cool forever. Same with Krom. Uh, and Cinderella, I put him here. Very, like, you know, a wrestling character. Uh, very cool. unique type of character to be in this oh, game. Oh, yeah, he's a Pokemon, too. Yeah, he's a Pokemon. So it was a lot of inspiration to draw from. Uh, you know, his trailer was dope. He has the title on his waist at all times. Yeah, he's the El Fuego champ. The the final smash is dope. Uh, the yeah, side beam introducing the ropes. Actual move. Yeah, like just stuff like that makes it cool to to look at. Um, you know, Star Fox people they've been cool always. Chrom is kind of just yeah. Chrom, you know, if you use Chrom, you kind of just know he's just cool. Hero, I put Hero here. Because his down, his his, his top decking move list, whatever, very unique. It's just very unique. No one else in the game has it. The skins, um, oh, you know, cool. it's just stuff like that. You know, hocus pocus, turning, all the combinations you can do, whack, all that stuff. Uh, kind of briefly explained why Simon is here. You know, it's just that he's just he's a cool, cool, definitely cool character. He had a great trailer. It's just that, you know, he's just the barbarian type. Ooh. And he's like, <laughs> you know, he's old. She combos, so she combos, cool design. Same thing with Meta Knight, you know. Pretty cool. Yeah, he's just very, you know, bread and butter, cookie cutter type stuff. Speed, yeah. Oh, Sheik's final like, smash actually makes her go up. Like, right. she can, you know, oh my gosh. The one yeah. It's like she's doing this whole Sheikah freaking like ritual beat beat up. Yeah, like. yeah it, one of the swaggers. Not gonna lie, it kind of reminds me of just a neutered down all out attack. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's just basically Greninja's, but they made it they made it something oh, different. Uh, and Meta Knight is kind of the same. It's just like Meta Knight, you know. Very, very straightforward. You know, know my you. power, you know. Yeah, know my cool power. Skin. Elite Edge Lord character. Mario's kind of. Really he has one of the best victory teams in the game, still, in my opinion. Mm, the rock and roll victory theme. It's the rock and roll version of Kirby and Diddy. Like, you can't deny that. Yeah, as he says, man. Our, our Mario, you know, he's kind of the end of this stick because. He's like, he's your very average character, but he can still, you, no one can tell me that whenever they see a Mario land a forward air, uh, they yeah, don't, you know, jump out of it. I literally broke a chair in commentary because of a Mario forward air. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was not there for that. Yeah, so the that's- The forward air by, uh, 
my boy. Half the boy. That's my name, bro. Uh, you know, I yeah. the best of us, you know. Now on to the, you know, creme de la creme, best of the best. The fraggy tier. Yes, the best of the best. The, 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 the characters that grace are tier. Let me see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. The 12 best swaggy characters. And, and of course, I only use swaggy characters. You know what I'm saying? You see, look at that. Yeah, look at that. Uh -oh. Oh. <laughs> All right, so historically, I want to go by history real fast since that would be easy. Snake, uh, Snake, Terry, Cloud, uh, and the Shotos. When everybody saw the trailer for Cloud to get in the game, they were very mind blown. Never thought something like that would ever happen. And a PlayStation rep going over to a Nintendo console. Exactly. Uh, it happened again, you know. First person to do it was like Snake, and then it happened with yeah. um, Sonic and then Cloud. Cloud. But like Cloud was a, Cloud, a cool character already, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So it wasn't a lot for him. It's not a lot you can say that makes him where, why he's here. Final Smash, great. Moveset, great just overall design and then snake when he came in and brawl very unexpected you know he had freaking the, the all the tactics for a stealth game you know he had the down throw which is like a choke out the gun his weapon his arsenal uh and the voice actor david hater just there. god like sonic what more can i say sonic adventure 2 sonic oh, heroes the movie, SA1. Except, you know, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's characters like that that make you feel like, wow, they're really in this game. Showed us. Can and breathe. Never think you would see a right. freaking fight. Right. Right. Finding out that Sonic got in the brawl was a highlight of my entire life. Come on, dude. I grew up with Sonic the Hedgehog. My first video game I ever beat was Sonic Adventure 2 on the GameCube. I showed the Dreamcast at my cousin's house. I beat the game right and then all that all that memory that goes into it and he ends up in this game and sonic hasn't swaggy been music swaggy music swaggy stage sonic hasn't Holy been the hell. best character since you know in brawl he was pretty good in smash 4 he was really good in smash 4. smash yeah, ultimate good. yeah smash ultimate he's kind of like in that upper upper echelon uh above average but i think his character just and his personality and everything, always cool. Uh, the Shotos, always, you know, and Terry, he kind of go in the same boat. Iconic, you know, his Ken's combos that you can do with the, the, the they, they fit so well with the, the inputs that they implemented in this game, you know, even though it's weird to do it on a, a GameCube controller, uh, Ryu, very, very, you know, staple in the fighting game community, as well as Terry. Uh, nobody thought you could have this character in here. And then we get to like Can Can Ganondorf and Captain Falcon. Those two have been in the game for a lifetime, and you always get excited to see a dare, a Falcon punch, Warlock punch, you know, side beam, reads. Me, like all these moves that they do, everybody gets excited. Uh, you know, mixing, fatality, uh, I don't know who uses Ganon, but you know, the, all those combos that happen mainly, and, all, and most hype sets are due to these two right here in every game. Yeah, I mean, I can't think of a game. They've always had some type of clip in every iteration. Um, Shulk, uh, again, one of the most unique characters in, in the entire roster. Uh, he was a great user. Well, 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 let's hold on there. Uh, he was a new character in Smash 4. He had, a, of course, the Nato Arts. A very iconic and original kind of mechanic. Yeah, from everyone in the game. Yeah, the uh, mechanic in the game, the stage, the music, the skins. <laughs> uh, Joker. 
<laughs> the taunts, yeah, the, that's right. The taunts, the meat, his victory screen. Awesome. Yeah, Joker. Like, oh, your name's like, come on. Bro, he was Swag garbage in Smash 4. He's pretty pretty good in this game. Early Smash 4, he wasn't garbage. Yeah, uh, I don't know anything about that. I didn't play it. Uh, but, uh, yeah, the shock hold, you know. You don't know about that. Uh, Joker, Richter. Uh, I don't, I never really knew about Joker, but I knew that once I saw that trailer, he, he was a very interesting person to look at with the arson mechanic. Yeah, you know, never played Persona 5 in his life. I had I won the most fun the Joker of the game out of the game. Remember yeah, I'm Joker, Joker you know? You two play Joker. You guys still yeah, yeah. do. I come in Joker. I still play him, but he's really fun. I can like it. There's lots of stuff of creativity. Uh everything's his animation. A cool, it's yeah, like a cool, gym, Final Smash, music, especially music. Yeah, the music, and the fact that, you know, you change the stage. Uh, yeah, the stage, depending on which music you're playing. Right, yeah, you know, that's kind of, that's very unique. You know, I like, her, I like, you know, originality, and that's what most of all these characters in the first two roles have is originality. Uh, Roy, even though know, he was a carbon copy of Mark Miller, he kind of got flushed out and he became a DLC. You know, he, had a, he went, he took the time away from Raw to go develop a, a unique move set, and then you know he came back in Smash Four, and he had everything he wanted: cool character, cool design, speed. You know, he, he had, yeah, he was the best, so he made him kind of like a comeback. Uh, he, you know, the whole skilled boy thing, and just overall, like the hilt of the sword mechanic, you know, pretty cool. pretty cool. Even in melee, he was pretty. I I wanted to use it, but I didn't play melee. Though. And then, obviously, last but not least, uh, Richter, like I said, young young boy. <laughs> One of the best poses, uh, one of the best victory animations in the game. My main, my actual main. Really cool punts, really cool swings. Uh, Have you seen, uh, listen, I know you guys seen me play before. Have you seen some of the crazy shit I've been able to pull off with this character? The downer up <laughs> Down no, I, You weren't at save point, John, when I hit Four down airs in a row, it's an up beat at zero and kill the guy. Oh, you mean oh, press the B button? <laughs> no, I literally went down air, down air, down air, down air, up B, insta kill them. Yeah, you know, stuff like that, that's pretty cool to happen. You know, he, like I said before, you know, Simon and Victor, they, they can, they are, they do have the ability to play stupid and lame. Oh, and but, takes us. But, just looking at them. Very great, Terry with the with the Buster Bolt, the Tower Geyser, all of this stuff with King of Fighters and Final Fatal Fury, the hats, the hat taunt, the learning knuckle, the fact that his freaking uh, power dunk can spike is very cool. But I think overall, this is a very legitimate list, no bias, even though. We kind of like just shit on these characters. There's a reason, you know. Nobody's looking at these characters. You know, wow, that's what I want to use. But yeah, I, I think it's a very cool list. Took some time, and this is legitimate, and I'm sticking to it. I think we're all sticking, even though some of them I can disagree with, but I can agree with this list. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. Mm. All right, so that's gonna do it. That is your official swaggy.
tier list for Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. 